so what is a normal extension this is the first question that comes to our mind an extension field we have been uh, so far studying about extension fields suppose this f is the given field that is given to us and e it's b it's extension field then we say this extension field would be a normal extension field of f if it satisfies any one of the following statements so the first statement here is it is also given that this field e this is an algebraic extension of f this is given to us such that it is contained in it is contained in f bar and what is this f bar f bar is the closure of algebraic closure of f so this is given to us so if the uh, if this field if every irreducible polynomial in f of x having a root in e splits into linear factor in e then we say this given extension is normal over f now notice that we use the word every here right and uh, in the second point the second point says that if e becomes the splitting field of the family of polynomials in fx so here you have many polynomials say f of x is one polynomial f1x f2x is another polynomial fnx is another polynomial fix is another polynomial for general i so all these polynomials are present in f of x and we say this field e forms the splitting field of our all these polynomials that means all these polynomials they will surely have roots in e and moreover these polynomials could be written as the product of linear factors in e if this thing happens we say our extension that is the normal extension next third point says every embedding what is embedding sigma from e to f so this is a mapping which is one one and homomorphism if a mapping is one one homomorphism we say ma'am screen pe kuch nahi dikh raha hai so it says every embedding what is embedding embedding is a mapping that is one one and homomorphism so now this mapping which maps every element of e to every element of f bar and it keeps elements of f as fixed this maps e on to e if this condition is true then we say the given extension field is also a normal extension so all the above statements they are equivalent we will prove this in uh, very recently that all these three statements are equivalent so it means that if any of these three thing is satisfied by any extension field then we say the given extension field is the normal extension field another definition which is parallel to this one it says that an algebraic extension e of a field f is called normal whenever you have an algebraic extension e of f and every irreducible polynomial in f of x so you have f here you have e here and you take a, any irreducible polynomial here so this polynomial say we take px so this polynomial should split into linear factors in e so this is what they are saying and it should be true for every such polynomial if that is the case we say our given extension field that is the normal extension so now you might be thinking that this is very similar to that of definition for splitting field we have done the same thing for splitting field but the difference here is that in splitting field we were only talking about the theory आवाज ही नहीं आ रही so here this definition is very similar to that of splitting field because in splitting field also we took one polynomial in this lower field and we were talking about the uh, splitting of this field into linear factors in this upper field e but now here the difference between splitting field and normal field it lies in the fact that in normal field we say there are a plenty of polynomials here say p1 p2 x pn x p i x there are so many polynomials here in f all of these polynomial they should uh, split into linear factors in e so this is what we are saying so instead of one polynomial which we have uh, 
which we took in splitting fields we now talk about the family of irreducible polynomials so what is this family of irreducible polynomials so usually what is the meaning of a family family is one which have different individuals and a single link the single link that is the parents right so family of irreducible polynomial is also Uh, having different polynomials which are all irreducible in nature so the single link over here is that of irreducibility and how do we mathematically express any uh, family uh, of polynomial suppose fix this is the family of polynomials how this is a family of polynomials here i belongs to this indexing set so that is known as the family of uh, polynomials why family because in this indexing set we have many numbers so according to this many numbers you have different polynomials in this family so the splitting field of any family of polynomials it consists of an extension field such that each polynomial splits into linear factors first thing and moreover the extension field which is generated over f by all the roots of this family of polynomials it should be generated by f and it should contain all the roots of polynomials fix present in this family so this is the definition and this is the meaning of family of irreducible polynomial in uh this right so next we have so let us see an example of normal extension of the given extension we all know that the field of complex number that is the field extension of this real numbers so now this is also the normal extension this is also the normal extension of the given field why because every polynomial in r whichever polynomial you take say x square plus 5 this is the given polynomial so it has roots in c what are the roots one is square root 5 iota another is minus square root 5 iota so these are the two roots for this particular polynomial and if you take any polynomial in r because by fundamental theorem of algebra we we know that c has its root in it the roots of that particular polynomial would be present in c so we say every polynomial in r splits into linear factors in c thus c acts as normal extension of the field of real numbers but the field of real numbers that is not normal over q why this is so so we are saying we know this q is the field extension q is the sub field of the field of real numbers or r is the field of uh, extension field of this field of rational numbers so if r is normal extension then all the polynomials in q they should split into linear factors in r this this is required for the definition of normal extension however we find one polynomial say x q minus 2 in this lower field q of x such that its root one of its root is x is equal to 2 to the power 1 by 3 but the other two roots they are complex in nature so they do not belong to r but according to definition it should have all the roots and uh, the polynomial should split into linear factors but th this is not happening for this particular polynomial hence we say that this is not the normal extension r is not the normal extension over the field of rationals next example is that of q alpha so we are saying this q alpha where this uh, q is the field of rational numbers that is adjoint with alpha so this is the normal extension this is the normal extension for this field of rational numbers where what is this alpha alpha is e to the power iota pi by 4 so we because we know what is e to the power iota theta this is equal to cos theta plus iota sin theta therefore e to the power iota pi by 4 this is equivalent to cos of pi by 4 plus iota sin of pi by 4 so this is our alpha now 
because this is the root of this polynomial. What is this polynomial? x raised to the power 4 plus 1 is equal to 0. This is the polynomial equation. So now we can calculate what is x from here. It would be minus 1 raised to the power 1 by 4. So we, we, we would be interested to calculate its root, the root of this particular polynomial here. So that could be found by uh, one of its root is this one, which is the uh, root of unity, right? The fourth root of unity. So when you take its power, so other root would be e to the power 2 iota pi by 4. Next root would be 3 iota pi by 4. Next root would be e to the power 4 iota pi by 4 and so on. So this, these are the four roots that are available in this Q alpha. Why uh, these are available in Q alpha? Because the basis set of Q alpha is 1 alpha alpha square and alpha cube. So we can say that this uh, Q alpha, this forms this normal extension over this uh, field of rational numbers for this particular polynomial x raised to power 4 plus 1. In fact, if you take any polynomial here, you can split that into linear factors in this polynomial. So I think you got the concept of uh, this uh, normal extension.